Hi, my name is Carl Weiland. I am one of the owners here at Weiland Doors. Recently, I traded with a customer a Weiland fiberglass personnel door for an FRP door from a competitor. So now I get to do experiments to see what I can learn about it. Corrosive liquid and vapor. Keep away from skin and eyes. Watch me saw, scrape, and tear this door apart and learn the differences that make Wyland FRP doors the best in the world. Every FRP door that's out there on the market uh, is laminated uh, besides ours. We use what's called a resin transfer process, resin transfer molding uh, for all of our panels. Um, basically, I like to describe the difference as being the difference between a sandwich and a burrito. Um, when you make a laminated door, you have two face sheets. And you're essentially gluing the door panel together like this. What we do is we wrap, um, we wrap our core material around fiberglass and it uh, it's, creates a superior um, thickness. So for example, here I'll show you this here. This is this door we just ripped here compared to our fiberglass. Look at the face sheet there. Uh, our fiberglass looks to be about twice as thick um, as this door. Um, one of the other big differences between this door when you look at it from this end is our fiberglass actually is continuous around all sides of the door instead of it being just a lamination. So you spray something, let's say this is 34 degrees over here and this is 72, and then all of a sudden this gets hit with something that's 170 degrees. If the rate of thermal expansion in this resin and this resin are different, it causes delamination. So you can see delamination occurring all around this door uh, where this crack is here. So that occurs, I mean, literally, So that's, uh, that's kind of what happens. Um, the door starts to delaminate over time and eventually the door has to uh, be replaced because of failure due to delamination. If moisture finds its way into the edge of this door and hasn't delaminated to the point where it needs to be replaced, moisture can find its way into the door. Um, that becomes a point for listeria um, and all kinds of uh, bad things to grow um, that are dangerous in food plants. So we don't like we don't like laminated doors. That's why we um, use a uh, a molded process. Um, but this door could be better if it was this door could be better if it was uh, if all the components were made out of molded fiberglass.